I just need someone to hold me accountable. That's what I hear all the time. I hear it on the daily, multiple times a day. And it's not not bad. I mean, that's kind of what coaches do, right? That's what we hire coaches to do. Or is it? You know, I recently joined a coaching program and a big selling point for them, not necessarily for me, but that they were pushing was the accountability piece, you know? And I was like, hmm, okay. But I guess accountability maybe means different things to different people. Sure. You can look it up in the dictionary and it has its definition, but I think our idea of what it means and what it does for us can vary, diff- very differently, <laughs> very a lot, <laughs> be very different. Um, so what do you believe it is? What do you believe accountability is and what does it do for you? Like I said, I just joined this coaching program and that was a big thing they were pushing. And I even told them flat out, I don't need that because I'm really good at holding myself accountable. If I decide to do something, I do it and I don't need anyone to make me do it. Maybe we see accountability as a confession. Maybe we see it as, you know, someone holding you to it, like you're going to get in trouble. I mean, that's because we were conditioned as kids, right? If you don't do what you're told, you get in trouble. Accountability is not a confession. It's about delivering on a commitment. It's about following through with what you said you would do. It's about integrity. So we aren't little kids anymore. We're not going to get in trouble. We don't need someone to discipline us, nor do we need anyone to um, make us do anything. You know, I don't care who the coach is. No one can make you do anything that you don't want to do. We were told that as kids, right? But then we were told different things. So I think we get messed up in our head and we get confused. What does accountability mean to you? Do you think of it as a confession and someone making you do it or, you know, holding you to account, which is actually the definition, or is it something else for you? Is it more about not letting someone down? That's what I think a lot of people think of it as. And I think that's a more accurate way to describe it. You know, if you are asking someone to hold you accountable, you're telling them what you're going to do and you don't want them to be disappointed in you. So that's why you do it. In fact, um, you're more likely, I talked about this on my podcast over uh, at the beginning of a year, I think last year, maybe over like the new year. And I talked about how much more likely you are to accomplish goals if you tell someone about it. And if I remember correctly, it was like 60% more likely if you tell someone. So maybe accountability isn't what you're looking for. Maybe that's not what is in the program that you really need. Like I said, I signed up for that program, not because I need accountability. I signed up for it because I need a blueprint. I wanted step-by-step instructions. I wanted someone to walk me through it and tell me exactly how to get from point A to point B, to how to accomplish the goal I was trying to reach. And I wanted an expert to get me there quicker and in a more streamlined fashion. So I didn't have to do all the research and I didn't have to go down the rabbit holes. Just give me the information, tell me how to use it, and we'll be on our way. And I think that's what a lot of my clients need too. I don't have very many clients that need to be held accountable in the traditional sense. I have a lot of clients who say exactly that to me. Tell me what to do and I'll do it. You don't need to babysit me. And I respect that. I respect that because that's how I am. There's nothing wrong with wanting accountability in the traditional sense. There's nothing wrong with wanting someone to make you do it you know, or hold you to it. That's cool. Especially if that's, you know, what you need in your season of life, but is it enough for you? Is having someone hold you to it enough? Having a partner at the gym, having someone at work or even at home hold you accountable can help. Um, putting it on social media can help, right? I had a friend at the gym tell me today, she came up and told me how much protein she was going to eat today because And then she said, if I know, if I tell someone, then I'll do it. So technically, I guess I was being her accountability partner, but I'm not, I, she's not asking me to check in with her. She's not asking me to follow up and make sure she does it. She just knew if she said it out loud and told someone she'd be more likely to do it. I don't think that's enough to get you there. I think that's enough for little goals like that, like eating enough protein or whatever, but to make a major life change, to change your lifestyle, to you know, accomplish bigger goals, just having someone hold you to it 
isn't enough, especially if holding you to it isn't the right thing to get you there. That's what I think is more important. It's the blueprint. It's the plan. It's the structure. It's the information that is for sure going to get you where you want to go. I mean, I can have you hold me to eating donuts every day. If that's what I said, right? (laughs) That's holding me accountable. But is it what I need to do what I want to do? Probably not. I do love donuts. I would love to meet them every day. (laughs) That would be amazing. So if you're like me and so many of my clients and you're pretty good at holding yourself accountable and what you really need is a blueprint and maybe someone to remind you to keep doing it or to keep going or encourage you, I've got something special coming and I want you to be the first to hear about it. So shoot me a DM and let me know that you need a blueprint. You need a plan. You're that kind of a person. And I'll share it with you first before everyone else hears it, because it's going to be amazing. And there, there's only going to be a limited number of spaces. <laughs> so as soon as I'm ready to announce it, I will announce it. But in the meantime, if you're the kind of person that may not need accountability, but maybe needs more of a blueprint or a blueprint and accountability, shoot me a message and let me know. I'd love to hear more about it and share my little secret with you. <laughs>